because fun with flags was taken already, we'll be talking about TV shows ranging from sci-fi all the way to chick flicks. And talking about shows that probably no one watches except for me and my fellow pop culture junkie nerds. So the first show I'm going to be talking about is a new one on sci-fi called Defiance. And it's going to be a no-go for me. It's really not that great, and I think it could be better. Now, one of the many reasons that I think that Defiance could be better is the characters. They lack a great background story. All of them. Now, I get it. The main character was in a war. He has an adopted daughter. You think, hey, this is going to be awesome. But that's all we know about him so far. I mean, come on, it's sort of been four episodes. I should be starting to develop to like my characters and be like, oh, I want to learn more about you. You intrigue me. Let's dive into your history. Where well, right now I'm like, you know what? I don't really care. You're not, you're not that awesome. So, character development needs to be higher. Also, did I mention it's boring? It's like any other sci-fi show. We got aliens not getting along. Trouble every day. Come on, this is things that we've seen all the time. Let's 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 get something a little better. I mean, right now I'd recommend recommend Warehouse 13, Doctor Who, or even old episodes of Fringe over Defiance. Now I'm not saying maybe it won't get better, but in my opinion, I don't know if it is. Now, also, where are the cool action scenes? There's only been like one major battle scene. Granted, it was okay, I was intrigued, but come on, if this is going to be an action sci-fi, you need at least one good action scene every episode, if you're going to keep an audience. Also, Dimension is boring. Also, how does everybody keep these alien languages straight? I mean, each race only has one language? That doesn't seem probable to me. Also, how did everybody learn these languages? I know not everybody does, did, but it does seem like that. That makes no sense to me because this is 10 or 15 years later and I don't see people picking up on that. Let's be honest here. Come on. Also, where is the plot going? I mean, come on. All we've done so far is, oh my god, the town's going to be in destruction. Next day, oh my god, the town's going to be in destruction. Then we go off the deep end in the next two episodes. Let's keep to a solid plot, flesh out our characters. And then maybe the show will be good. Let's not go on side trips when we know nothing about our characters yet. Or about our plot. You want to keep your audience captivated. But that doesn't do it. Also, I think sci-fi could do better. I mean, this is the network that brought you Stargate and Farscape. I expect more from you. And I mentioned the reboot of Battlestar Galactica. Come on, sci-fi. Let's do better. Overall, I'm not satisfied with this. I'd say it's boring. I hope Sci-Fi picks it up in the next few episodes. But I will give Defiance this. I like the whole idea of gaming. It's intriguing. It's new. Maybe that will save the show. I don't know. I do like Daytag's wife. Maybe she's our darker character that we haven't seen yet. Maybe they'll flesh him out more. Right now, I'm not hopeful. But for those of you who like the show, I hope it gets better.